Well, at 633, it is a big night tonight in the Fayetteville Manlius School District. Tonight is the first high school football game on the new turf field. Joining us live from the new field is the FM Athletic Director, Rich Roy, with more on how months of fundraising helped make this turf field a reality. Uh, good morning to you. Good morning, Megan. All right, well, let me uh, start with this. This almost didn't happen. As you know, uh, taxpayers voted this proposal down twice. It then took a, a private group of folks to raise all this money to make this a reality. Well, it, uh, uh, people recognize the need. There was a group of people that still recognize the need for this facility to um, uh, for not only for this, uh, our athletic program and our physical education program, but for the community. And uh, they just felt they weren't going to be deterred, deterred and um, put together a, a committee and worked over three years to make this happen. So for those who are uncertain about uh, the differences here, can you explain to us what the difference is between the old grass fields that many of us remember growing up with and these new turf fields that you're standing in front of? Yeah, the, the grass field is, uh, again, you know, look, look at the rain that we had last week. Uh, you know, grass field will change all the time. It'll get muddy and soft or it'll get hard pan. This artificial turf field with the cr crumb rubber as a, as a pristine every time you use it, no matter how many times you use it all year long. The weather doesn't affect it. Last Wednesday we had a, a deluge here during a girls soccer game and the uh, footing and the, and the safety of it was uh, constant, which you wouldn't get with a grass field. You know, these turf fields are pretty common actually across the country. There are so many schools that have them. Um, are you surprised that it took so long to make it a reality here? Well, yeah, I'm a little bit, sure. I, you know, I think uh, when we look at our league, there were 75% of our league members had the turf field. So we're a little dismayed that it took us this long to get it. But again, uh, it, we have to thank a group of, of diligent people who recognized the need and said, we're going to make this happen. Certainly will, and it will tonight. The first game uh, beginning at 7 o'clock tonight there at FM High School. Rich Roy, the athletic director, thanks for joining us. I guess your shirt says it all this morning. We did it. Uh, so congratulations, and uh, we'll look forward to a great game for you all tonight. Thank you. All right. Well, it is 636 right now. And